Hello and welcome back to the colony with Man of the Ants. Playing once again some of the delightfully cute moss, which I'm super excited about, and it seems you guys are enjoying it as well, so that's always good to know. So we ended last time on this puzzle here. We've got this dude who we can move to this. Ah, wrong, wrong button. If we can move to this button here, which opens that, and then I can rot rotate this and rotate this. And do what, I wonder? Well, I can get moss over here. Moss, I can get quill over here. Ah, oh, so cute! A pico. What does the second button do, I guess, is the question. Hmm. So what I'm thinking is I could bring this over here, run moss on the other side. Oh, that doesn't. Oh, of course, yes. So what I can do is I can rotate this around and then get confused. And then get confused. Yes. Yes, hello. Hello, Quill. She's telling us how to do the puzzle. She's telling us how to do the puzzle and I didn't quite get it. She comes off those doors are gonna close, so I need the this thing over here. Oh, I, I'm an idiot. Yep, I got it. She can run through there. This thing I can drag through here, because Quill can stand on that button, of course. It all makes sense now, doesn't it? He can stand on that. It, I suppose. And then I can spin this around. And then, Quill can jump up there. I love that she mined the, uh, what was needed to complete the puzzle. That is so cute. There we go. High five. <gasps> Everyone else saw that, yeah? Because that was so bloody cute. I love the fact she's interacting with you and sort of, oh, that's so good. That's so nice. I mentioned last time about the animation of Quill climbing up the ledges and stuff and how delightful that seemed to be. And Andy, who is a professional animator himself, uh, fully agreed with me, but that that whole little sit, uh, set up there with her showing you what to do and then the high five at the end, that was absolutely sublime. Okay, so we can go down there, we can see that. We can also head up there. Why would we want to go down there rather than going up the big door. I'm going to guess if we go to the big door that we uh, can't go that way and we're forced to come back this way. That's what, that's my assumption. Let's go find out. Yeah, cause the doors are not lit up yet as I would expect them to be if I could open them. So we need to get something in this fire. We need to get the fire lit, I'm thinking. Maybe that's what we need to do. But for now, let's head back. Because, yeah, we definitely need to go over to the right first. There's a lever over there, I can see. Look, I guess we need to make our way over there. What have we got here, Quill? What have we got? What's going on? Kind of sat on my cable. That's what's going on. So I guess some enemies are going to come out that little hole over there, or definitely that one at the top. That looks like an enemy hole, doesn't it? That one there as well, actually. There's a scroll hidden behind those over there. I'm assuming this uses left eye tracking, does it? It's a little hard to... Maybe it doesn't, actually. Does it not do either? Does it actually do, like, an actual middle ground? Oh, I can't really tell. Okay. No enemies have immediately arrived, which is, uh... Shocked me a little bit. Here we go, yes. 
Oh! Super enemies. Don't know if I was expecting super enemies. Oh! Definitely wasn't expecting that. Off we go, Quill. Uh, so they're nice and weak, which is awesome, obviously. How does she... Uh... Oh, careful, Quill. No, 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 Quill. There we go. Come on now, up there. No, it's not that. Go like over this way. No, 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 Quill, get up. Now, it looks like those are far enough away that they can't quite get me, so let's heal Quill up. Ah. Ah. Okay, right. Now I see. I tried jumping out of the way, but it failed miserably. Hide over here, Quill. You didn't hide very well. Hide better, Quill. Again, not very good. Oh. Damn you. This is a little tricky. This is a little tricky indeed. Any more going to come out? Going to come out and play? Oh, I didn't think so, you chickens. Damn, okay. We can do better than that, that's fine. Nicely done, Quill. Nicely done. I take it back. You're useless. You're a disappointment to everyone. You shame your family and you shame me. What do they call me? Watcher? Helper? I can't remember. Oh, damn. I didn't move that one down. Reader. I was a reader, wasn't I? That's just stupid. I wasn't even thinking. Why can't she get in there? There's definitely something there. And if you jump, she just does a slam attack, so I can't exactly... Well, I can go in there and smash all those. That's something I can do. I'll heal you up in a second, Quill. Let me just get you out of the uh, harm's way. Yeah, I'm really not too sure here. Oh, there we go. Being a bit silly, apparently. Nicely done, Quill. We managed to get through that without dying, which I was quite impressed with. That didn't seem like that was going to be the case for some time there. What is that? Obviously I can spin this around. And I kind of lift that up or something? No. 
Oh, I see. So I think we're going to go and pull this lever, and this lever's going to let out... Oh, you idiot. Gonna let out bad guys. That's what I'm thinking. Yeah, there we go. Oh, interesting. So, I can bring Quill over here. She can stand on the button. I can bring this guy up here so he's at the right level. And he can shoot those, which brings that up. If I move him out of the way. Does he stay? No, he doesn't. Okay. There's another one appeared, but that's not a problem. We can just leave him be. I wonder if we could get up the top there. Let's find out. I don't... Oh, I was going to say I don't think we could. We definitely can look. So this you would have thought would take us back to that lever. Yep, that lever. That's exactly the one I was thinking of. That lowers that gate. So is that just a shortcut back? But it's not really much of a shortcut. Oh, could, yeah, no, you do, because we couldn't get back that way, could we? Because we had to jump down. Right, okay. So that's why that's there. It's not a secret. It's where we actually have to go. So a couple more things for us to shoot. There's a little bad guy wandering around back there. There's a switch there. There's a lever there to get a bad guy out to shoot these things. I'm guessing this is going to turn into a staircase. Door there. There's a scroll up there. Another entrance there by the look of it. I'm not sure if I've actually looked behind me in this game. Oh, no, I definitely did, didn't I? In the uh, Forest of the Dead, as we'll call it. Now we can rotate it, yes? Yeah, of course we can. So we can get Quill. Where can we get Quill? Well, I suppose up there. Can she get up there? Can't get up anymore, can I? Okay, well, uh, well, let's try and figure that out, shall we? Yeah, because it looks like you're meant to be able to grab up there, maybe, but that seems like it's too far away. It's definitely too far away. So where can she go? Because I don't think she can be able to jump up there because of that being in the way. I don't know if she can hit these. Or well, she can. Okay. To what end? Well, that one raises and lowers those. So the next question is, what does this one over here do? Ah. Okay. So that's going to allow us to get over here. Just going to bring us up to the top here. Which is going to allow us to get over here and pull this lever. And that's going to bring out a shooty McGee. 
Thank you, Shooty McGee. Don't make a liar of me. So now... Thank you. Now... Hmm... Don't shoot, Quill. I'm trying to think how that allows us to get up to the top. So we still need to get that one over there, and I don't... Oh, I don't mean to do that. I don't think... I have to drag him, don't I? That's what was confusing me. I don't know that he can shoot that one. He cannot. He cannot shoot that one. But he can shoot that one. Okay, let's get Quill over to this one. Take it from there. So I guess the question here is, can Quill make that jump? Not like that, but it looks close. Looks like she should be able to, doesn't it? And then there's no edge for her to grab onto. If he shoots that from here... Ah, but... Quill can jump up here. And then she can jump up here. And then... She can jump there. There we go. Got there in the end, and then she can get that portal. That portal. Too much Path of Exile, thought it was a portal scroll. Then we can bring her over here. Trying to rotate this with uh, this thing now. She can jump over here. She needs to take care of this dude. Which I think she's already done. Nicely done. Whoop, whoop. Then she can go up there. Perfect. Perfect. Oh, hello. Treasure room or trap? That's the question we have to ask ourselves here. And time to find out. Treasure room, shield. Ooh. I'm assuming it's a shield. Um, yeah? Do I have to do something? Oh, do I have to? Yes. Ah, <gasps> you can stroke her little head. You can stroke her little head. What's the shield do then? Do I just have to carry it for now? Is that what's happening? Where did we... Oh, we came from down there, didn't we? That's fine. can get through there and then here we go over here I'm glad I noticed that in that door and actually thought about that because that seems like one of those things that could really confuse you for uh, some time wondering how to get back 
Those are, uh, those are gerbils or hamsters, aren't they? They're not mice. If I noticed there are different... Different rodents around before? Does that mean there are rats? Are rats the bad guys again? Are rats, are rats are always the bad guys. Ah, it's the key. Not, nothing to do with fire. I lied. I lied to you all and I'm so sorry. I can't... Oh, wasn't quite tracking that far. No high five? High five, little quill? No. Okay, well that... Oh, it's just a chain. I thought it was some sort of weird tentacle creature. That seems like an appropriate place to stop then, doesn't it? Or is something about to happen? No, we're good. All their, um... Braziers are lit, look. Braziers? I never know. Never know. They're all lit either way, so that's something. That's changed. That's interesting. So yes, there we go. We're going to leave that there. We'll come back to this particular room in Quill next time around and see if we can figure it out. Are those little mice angels up there? Like little mice gargoyles. That is so cute. Hope you've enjoyed this latest look at... I keep calling it Quill now. I hope you enjoyed this latest look at Moss. If you have, please do click the like button. It's really appreciated. There's a button above there. Look, so that's going to unleash the chain, which is going to know. There's not enough room for it to swing. We'll figure it out next time. Anyway, I'm getting, getting myself carried away. Yes, do click the like button if you've enjoyed it. It really does help me out quite a lot. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Any questions or comments, leave them down below and I'll get back to you as soon as I see them. Don't forget, I do stream every Wednesday at 6 p.m. Oh, I wanted to high five you. Every Wednesday at 6pm, it'd be lovely if you can come along and say hello there. Otherwise, I'll see you next time in the single most adorable game. Oh, don't do that. That's significantly less adorable. That gets kind of creepy, doesn't it? Let's take away part of her face. Yeah. Not, not quite as creepy anymore, Quill. Anyway, I'll see you next time. And as always, thank you very much for joining me.